guys, it's me, Beauty Bee Nails. I just want to come on screen and say hello, and I just want to give you guys a big thank you because I finally hit over a 1K, and I'm super, super excited, very excited that I hit over a 1K, thanks to you guys. But anyways, I'm going to be doing my nails, I'm going to be taking all these off, and we're going to be doing a review as well. I'm going to be reviewing this brand here. This is... Verano came in this box already like this it was super nice um I did get this on Amazon um I'll link it down below for you guys so that way you can go check it out anyways guys I just wanted to come on here and show this this mug of mine <laughs> and I hope I didn't scare y'all off I'm sorry so so sorry <laughs> anyways guys I hope you enjoy the video stay tuned to the end and make sure you hit that big old thumbs up button guys go ahead and subscribe if you are not subscribed and let's get into this video thank you guys really high um, hypernicium underneath so sometimes I have different forms I have to cut out a little piece that way it'll fit right underneath my nail first of all let me get it in my fingers here um, I've always had it did some forms will fit really good and then some forms don't just depends on the form itself 
but I just push it back to where it feels comfortable and I just go ahead and lock in that tab. You want to make sure that these are even as possible. But I always have to cut that little piece out so it'll fit like right. I always want to look and make sure that that middle is like right in the middle of your finger. This one is, so we're just going to go ahead and do this one. First of all, i got to put that base coat on. It does take a little longer when you're doing forms, I feel like. Um, compared to using dual forms because dual forms you can literally just put it inside the dual form pop it on you're good but with this you have to um, put the form on put the base coat on you don't want to over flood your nails either because you know you're um, you don't want to over flood it you don't want that base coat to run in your fingers or nothing Now, they did send glitter with it, with this package. I like the glitter, it's really pretty. I was going to use the silver in it, I think. And like I said, do remember you also get these as well. You get these little rhinestones that are super, super, super nice. Really like the rhinestones. They're so cute. You get several different colors. You get like a rainbow color, blue, silver, or uh, blue, and then you get like crystal, and then it's like a rainbow effect, and then these are like the AB ones. All right, guys. So I'm gonna mix some glitter together. I actually am gonna be mixing this here. I got this from AliExpress, and from it's called the Colors World beautiful glitter love this glitter it's totally amazing so beautiful and so I have to have this red this inside of here shouldn't take a hope.
Araka, so that is the Burano poly gel kit and everything you get in it you get everything that you see here and the forms you actually get the forms there but that's everything that comes in this kit including a top and a base you get diamonds glitter tool dual forms you get actual fitted forms as well and you get the directions on how to apply but this is the set that I came up with for my Halloween they are gorgeous. I absolutely loved this poly gel and how it applied. It did so good. It was so amazing. I absolutely love it. And it turned out so clear too. Like I was really shocked at the soft pink. You could actually see the glitter through it. But um, if you're applying glitter, the only thing that I have to tell you is that when you're when you're actually putting a coat over top of the um, glitter, you have to put a very thin coat in order to actually uh, see the glitter because I did one of them and it didn't show up as good let me see it was this one here it didn't show up I mean it's still really pretty but it um, was a little bit cloudy like compared to the other ones because the other ones showed up beautiful but that is the design I came up with. Let me know what you think. Make sure to leave me a comment down below, guys. I love talking to you guys. It's amazing. Um, I try to always respond as quick as I can. If I don't, it's either because I'm at work or whatever, but I do get back to you as soon as I can. And um, I wanted to give a big shout out to Princess Nails Diana for being first on my video. Whoop whoop, I love her, she's a doll. And I'm so excited for this kit. If you guys do not have this kit, you do need to purchase this kit. This is amazing. But I used the soft pink only. I'm going to show you how much of it I use, though. So, I did a full set. As you can see, I mean, it's still got some on the top of it here, too. But these are only 15 gram sets. I was able to do a full set of nails. Um, I did have to redo one of the nails because I popped it off today while I was at work. So I did actually do one more nail. But this, I still probably have enough to maybe do like, you might get by with maybe one more set. But you would have to be like really thin layers. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. And I will uh, do the rest of these poly gels throughout the month and so, so. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you tried this brand and what your opinion is on it. This is probably some of the softest poly gel that I have ever used, but literally, like, it applied so good. I love their slip solution. Their slip solution is great. It doesn't have a smell or anything like that to it. It's actually perfect. Everything just applied really good. The base coat was amazing. Top coat is it's on the kind of a, I don't want to say it's a thin consistency because it's kind of like in between, but it's more on the thinner side. But I really like that they gave you glitter and diamonds to have that option. I was going to do some bling on it, but I decided to wait for that next mani. But yeah, I really love these nails. I think they, they it was like some of the easiest poly gel to follow too. But you definitely have to make sure that they are cured all the way through anywhere from two to four minutes. If it's not completely cured, you will be able to tell it won't really file that well. So, but anyways, guys, I really love it. I really, really recommend this brand. Make sure you go check them out. I'll leave the link in the description box for you guys. So that way, if you're interested in this poly gel kit, you can go check it out on Amazon. And I just want to say thank you guys so much. I love you all. I hope you are having a wonderful, wonderful time right now. And hope everybody had a great Halloween. I love you guys. Bye.